A Kalispell neighborhood is trying to calm down after a home exploded, then caught on fire on Saturday. Reporter Katie Harris spoke with a neighbor who is happy her home was saved during the incident. The Kalispell neighborhood of Coot Court was stirred up this weekend when this home exploded and then burst into flames. I'm still shaking, though, and that was Saturday. <laughs> Priscilla King is a neighbor and thought she heard a loud clap of thunder, and then she thought she saw snow falling. When I came down the hall, it looked like it was snowing, and I thought it can't, it can't be snowing, you know, but it was all the insulation that was coming down out of the sky. And so I opened the sliding door and looked over next door, and there was no wall or roof of the back bedroom there. And so a neighbor across the fence hollered at me to get out of the house, that it's gas. So I just grabbed my purse and my dog and drove down the street to get away. What makes this story even more interesting is that a single bullet may have caused the explosion. Earlier that day, a gun went off, sending a bullet through the floor and into a crawl space. The bullet may have struck gas piping or a furnace located in that area of the crawl space. But fire investigators won't know if the bullet is to blame or if it was two separate odd incidents until the investigation is complete. The Kalispell Fire Chief says although this incident is still under investigation, there are some steps you can take to prevent your home from catching on fire or from preventing an explosion. Check your furnaces, your gas appliances, make sure they're vented right, CO2 detectors. King's home suffered some damage from the heat of the blaze that ensued after the explosion. Her siding was melted, along with fragments of glass embedded into the surface. King says she's just glad her house was saved and that her neighbors were gone when their house exploded. Thank God there was nobody in the house. That's the first thing I thought of, you know. I thought, oh my God, you know, they, they couldn't live through that. Fire investigators will know by Wednesday if the explosion site will be excavated for the investigation. In Kalispell, I'm Katie Harris for Montana's News Station.